350Z, I'm coming for you. There's something about it, isn't there? I think today is the day. I keep saying this. Well, first of all, shout out to Tyler. Always, always got me. He's driving me. Okay, so backstory. We're going to look at a 350Z right now. This will be the 10th 350Z I've went to go and look at. I have literally cash in hand to buy this car. If everything lines up to what it's set, what the, what the guy says it is, I will be buying this car. So I was looking at it. I found the car with like a day after it was posted, and we're talking, and it got kind of confusing. Like when we were talking over text about the location where we wanted to meet. So I was like, Yo, can I call you, and we'll just figure this out. He's like, Yeah, sure. So I gave him a call, and he goes, Yo, 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 this is so and so, uh, the owner of the 50. I was like, Yo, dude, what's up? My name's TJ, and he goes, Wait, what? Is this TJ Hunt? And I was like. Yeah, this this is him and so long story short. This is actually a bro's car This is a subscribers car. So how dope would it be if I ended up buying a subscriber 650z? So I'm really hope this one looks so good. It looks clean. It's a salvage title now Let me tell you why that's okay. And while why I am okay with the salvage title. It's just a front end Well, it had a front end like damage. That's what caused it to salvage title now all 350Zs, pretty much at this point, all it takes is a simple fender bender and it will salvage title the car. Because they're just getting cheap these days. So anything pretty much puts in salvage title that uh, something very, very minor can make a salvage. So the salvage title does not bother me. It has 74,000 miles, it's a 2006. It's a DE motor, which just so I was more so looking for an HR, but this is a very, very low mile DE, which, which is a very good sign. It has an upgraded stage one clutch and a lightened flywheel, which is awesome. It has Nismo wheels on there. It's red, which is what I wanted. And uh, it looks pretty, pretty clean on the interior, which is a huge plus. There's a dent in the rear passenger side panel, which does not bother me at all because remember, this is going to be a drift track car. So if anything, I'm gonna put more damage on it than what's, what's already there, so I'm totally fine with the dent in the back. It's not that bad, but it is there. Uh, but for me, the salvage title and that dent totally, totally fits what I'm looking for because it's gonna be my drift car anyway, it's gonna get beat up. So enough of me rambling. Let's get on. I'm so excited to see this car. I think this is the day. We're following the nav <laughs> and it just put us on a dirt road. If you hug the right. What is your Subaru got on this? Oh my God. Yeah, <laughs> where, where's the Subaru when we need it? Thanks a lot, Google Maps. This road's just dirt. Okay, my car's not too lowered. I know, thank God you're not slammed. <laughs> I'd be fucking hosed if I went this way. I'm getting nervous. It's like a, it's a good nervous, but it's like, ooh, I'm getting nervous. I'm getting nervous. I don't know why. It's a good nervous, but I'm getting nervous. It said it was the there it is. There we go. Yeah, that's it, right next to him. All right, bros, here we go. I figured you were gonna ask. I'm like, he's gonna, gonna ask. I'm gonna film on the car list. <laughs> when I called you, I was like, no way. This is Tyler, by the way. Yeah, this sounds really not that bad. I was gonna say, I'm gonna be taking it as my track car anyway. You said that you're gonna get a 350Z. I was yeah. like, no way. Yeah. It made me wanna keep it and see what yeah. you do so I could do it. Let me show the inside. So, inside, this is what I was looking for. Like, yeah, this is there. really good condition. This is clean. Do you see how the, these pieces kind of Enough. Yeah. I uh, masked it and spray painted with uh, a yeah. vinyl mm -hmm. frame. Like the fact that this opening closes uh, is a huge yeah. sign that it's in good condition. Yeah. And this then, is normally the first thing that breaks. Oh shit. But it looks sick though, man. I'm really hyped, man. I'm really. Jay's like hammering this guy with questions. Like, seriously, shout out to Jay's Two Cents. I'm gonna link him down below. He's like been my mentor. And like, like he's like he's babied me through this this Z process. Man, I couldn't be more thankful. He's the one with, with that 370Z Nismo that I reviewed. We're gonna take it for a spin here in a little bit, but like this is this is the condition I was looking for so far. I'm really excited. I'm trying not to show it. <laughs> yeah! Holy shit! <laughs> I'm gonna do it one more time. You beat me, I get it. <laughs> oh, 
Jay's back, driving the car to see how it went. Moment of truth. If I get his blessing, we're going home with a new car. Oh, for a 06 Nissan 350Z for my man TJ. Good bros, <laughs> the drift build is here. Huge shout out to Jay. I, to I've t I already told him. This this is like the mentor. Like, like we said, we, you know, in Pawn Stars, they're like, hold on, I got a friend that knows about this stuff. Let me give him a call. <laughs> this is this is my forte. Yeah, this, this is this is it. I All think, right. I think he's making a huge mistake. <laughs> we have done it. It's over, baby. We finally got it. Holy shit. Thank y'all so much for watching. The search is over. You guys will see a lot more videos here soon. Thank you for watching. Peace out and keep moving forward. gonna document the first gas fill up. I'm like, I don't even know how to open the gas cap. I don't even know where it is yet. Oh, JK, found it. Oh, let's go get gas. Oh. Dude, driving, that thing bouncing off the walls is loud. That's crazy. <laughs> Looks so good. So driving it, it drives, drives pretty well. There's some things that need to get fixed here pretty soon, but I'll come out in later videos. I was just showing you guys the getting gas footage. First fill up ever. See this way, this way you take to the bloopers. You see, you see all this good stuff.